Hello! Welcome to Unicorn Princess Tarot. So, ito pong aking reading para sa mga Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. Please do know this, that this is a general love reading for November 2020 and December 2020. So, pwede kang hindi makarelate dito. Kung hindi ka makakarelate, huwag nyo pong ipilit. Ibig sabihin lang po, hindi para sa inyo ang message na ito. Pero kung makakarelate ka, maaaring um, hindi 100% relate ha. Kunin mo lang kung saan ka makakarelate. So, makakarelate ka, kunin mo yung mga messages dahil pwede makatulong ito sa'yo so start na po natin so pwedeng ikaw to cross watcher pwedeng ikaw to libra or pwedeng ito yung person mo ah, I'm sorry hindi ito yung kailangan ko okay. I really want this card para kuha na ng main energy kunin muna natin yung main energy ng person mo libra what do we have here for libra sun moon rising and venus sign ah, hindi ko to kukunin I only, with, I only need one or hanggang two. What do we have here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign? Okay. For Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. So, your person's main energy is the Four of Cups. Then, kukuha naman tayo main energy mo. main energy mo is the empress and the moon yeah and kuha naman ako ng um, card from this deck what do we have here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign thank you We have here, be authentic, practice compassion, and have faith. Kukuha na rin po ako ng mga cards para sa next row. Para makuha natin yung clarity. Para sa mga ano. Sa upper row. What do we have here for Libra? Sa mga rising and mini sign. For Libra. Sa mga rising and mini sign. Hindi ko po yung kinuha kasi minsan magkukumpulan yung cards. And ibig sabihin lang nga, hindi para sa inyo yun. Hindi, hindi yun para kunin. What do we have here for? Thank you. Five of Wands. One last card for Libra okay wait lang guys ah okay so you could be dealing with the Scorpio Pisces I'm sorry Scorpio Pisces Cancer with the four of cups seven of wands five of wands Leo Sag Aries or Gemini with the lovers yun But what I can see here, I see an offer here. May nakikita akong offer dito with regards to your person eh. It could be you giving this offer. Oh. Pero pwede rin namang yung person mo ang nag-offer sa'yo. Take what resonates. I feel like for some of you, you are well concentrated on yourself. Concentrated ka masyado sa sarili mo eh. I feel like this time you're using your intuition or mas mas pinakikinggan mo yung um yung kutub mo. Okay? And I feel like with the offer right here with the four of cups, I feel like um you're planning currently yung actually this is your person planning for the future or eto nga this 2021 maaaring pinaplano niya yung para sa inyo ngayon. With the seven of wands, someone is traveling. So, pwedeng may travel na mangyayari. So, pwedeng yung plano is regarding that. And with the five of wands, I feel like someone here is really concentrated dito sa sarili niya. Especially if you are having this feeling na parang medyo low or parang gusto mong mag-ayos, magpaganda. Kung lalaki ka, magpapogi. Kasi, 
uh, maaaring with the travel right here, you would like to see this person um, personally. I mean, eto yung parang parang you're planning for a date. Pwede yung person mo planning for a date or planning for ayun nga, date or yung makita kayo. Why? I mean, I see you you really love this person and there's lots of love here. And I feel like gusto mong ibigay ang lahat sa kanya. Kaya lang parang nagdadalawang isip ka. Would he or she love me back? With the lovers right here, I see a relationship here with you and your person. And it feels like you're planning for this person na parang bigyan siya ng something special pag nagkita kayo. But be authentic. Kung natatakot ka na kung ano man yung maging response niya sa'yo, magpakatotoo ka lang sa sarili mo. Okay? I don't know. High chance of pregnancy by the way ha. So, kung hindi ka pa ready, you know, take contraceptives. Let's see. What do we have here for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign? Masyadong... I will take this. We have here the hangman, six of wands. Three of swords, five of swords. And four of swords. Wow, could be dealing with the Gemini Libra Aquarius here. Or Aris Leo Sag. Yan. Tanay kita ko dito. I feel like. I mean, I feel like someone here is waiting. This could be your person waiting at you. Waiting at this offer. Waiting for this communication. Or waiting para magkita kayo. He or she is waiting. Naghihintay lang. Pero, with the six of wands, I feel like your person, although naghihintay siya, pwedeng ikaw to. I see a person here, or other person, not only one, not only two. For some of you, three person involved here ang gustong um, kumonek dito sa person mo. And you know what? Your person is very well open. Okay? So, maaaring may mga lumalandi sa kanya ngayon. And, take note, your person is so beautiful or pwedeng may itsura talaga yung person mo. Kaya, it felt like, you, for some of you, medyo, you feel like, um, you feel low or yung emotion mo is parang isip ka ng isip, ganyan. How would he react or how would she react? Kasi yung itsura mo eh, hindi naman talaga kagwapuhan or kagandahan. And compared to your person, maaaring yun yung bumabagabag sa'yo. For some of you lang ha. And pwede nyang may third party involved dito. Maaaring, um, for some of you, maaaring nararamdaman mo yon through your person's, um, kung paano siya, kung paano siya makitungo sa'yo. For some of you, padang iniisip mo, naaawa lang sa'yo yung person mo, kaya kanya siguro sinagot. Or kung ikaw ay lalaki, or ay kung ikaw ay babae, kaya kasi siguro niya, kaya siguro siya nag stay sa relationship niyo, kasi naaawa na lang. Um, kasi nga maraming nag admire dito sa person mo. I can see your person, someone is admiring your person. And there's a lot of offer na tinatanggihan niya. Pilit niyang tinatanggihan. Gusto niya actually, gusto niyang tanggapin eh. There's an offer here. So, pwedeng maraming nga naliligaw talaga sa kanya. So, kung babae, itong kakonek mo, maraming gustong, um, you know, gustong nagpapapansin sa kanya. But parang, ang nasa isip niya is, no, I'm already committed. Kung lalaki naman siya, ganun din. Maraming nagpapapansin. Kaya lang, you know, ang sinasabi niya, I'm already committed. I'm already committed. And kaya lang, well open siya open pa rin siya sa mga ganon. I feel like nakikipag, you know, if there are chats, nakikipag palitan pa rin siya ng chat. So, sabihin na natin sinasabi niya committed siya, pero nandito yung pakikipaglandian na nakikita ko. 
and although he or she is waiting yeah a lot of people are really trying to have her or him yun nga nagre-reach out so although may connection kayo or in relationship kayo um you know tama lang na you you are bothered here with the four of swords and the three of swords pero alam mo Nakikita ko dito, nagmamahal ka naman eh. Pero maraming sinasabi sa'yo yung intuition mo or yung kutob mo. Or parang nawawalan ka na ng tiwala. Kaya parang down na down ka, sobrang nasasaktan ka ngayon. Or, ayun nga, marami kang iniisip ngayon. Especially tuwing gabi. Kasi nga, yung person mo is, um, maybe nawawalan ng time or sinasabi matutulog na and then you would see na, o bakit active pa siya, sabi matutulog na daw, ganun. Maraming pagdududa dito, yung nakikita ko. Hindi ko ito kukunin, pero ito kukunin ko. Wow. Okay, so November to December 2020, I see something here. Alam mo, although napakaganda ng person mo or napakapogi niya, for what I can see here, hindi ka naman niya binibitawan. Okay? Uh, for some of you, pwedeng yung, yung offer is regarding family or yun nga, a deeper level of commitment. Kaya lang, for some of you, pwedeng you're not so sure, masyado ka lang nagmamadali, or gusto mo lang talagang lumevel up agad yung commitment nyo, maaaring kasi na-develop ka na ng husto sa kanya. Kaya lang, I see someone here na medyo may bakas pa ng nakaraan. So, and ano mo, yung person mo masyado pang immature. Huwag ka muna masyado magmadali. For what I can see here, I'm sorry, nawigil yung camera. So, huwag ka masyado magmadali. Kasi for what I can see here, masyado pa namang uh, maaga eh. Kung baga, i-allow nyo lang yung feelings and yung emotion nyo na magkita kayo. Ganyan. And to shine. Ganyan. But, uh, have faith kung ano man yung pagdadaanan pa ninyo ng relationship nyo, magtiwala ka lang. So, let's see. King of Pentacles of Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. Marami pa, marami pa itong patutunguhan eh. Kaya lang, I don't know. Ang nahihita ko kasi masyado pang bata eh. Pwedeng hindi bata na ano, pwedeng immature lang talaga. Yung person mo. Pwedeng immature lang siya. Oh. Okay. You know what? It says here, past life relationship could be dealing with an ex right here. Kung hindi ikaw tong may kadil na ex dito, pwedeng yung person mo. Retreat, it's time to disconnect from the world. You deserve love. You are lovable. Kung sa tingin mo, actually, the advice here is to have faith. Magtiwala ka lang. Saan? Sa intuition mo. Nakikita ko yung have faith eh. Pero hindi para sa relasyon nyo. Magtiwala ka sa kutob mo. Kung nakukutuban mo na may hindi na talaga maganda, na hindi na okay, na you feel like you are, a, you know, parang kang mis, hindi naman mistress. <laughs> parang may mistress ang datingan. So, pwede nga yung person mo ang may mistress. And you are the legal wife. You feel like yung person is my... Kung hindi legal wife, ikaw ang unang girlfriend. Sabihin ng ikaw ang babae, ha? Pero take what resonates. Pwedeng ikaw yung lalaki. Okay. Ang pakiramdam na nakukuha ko dito is kunin mo yung kutob mo. Maniwala ka sa kutob mo. Have faith. Trust your faith in this situation. Pero hindi sa sitwasyon na to. Magtiwala ka dito sa isang card na nagpakita dito, which is the moon. Signifies kutob, intuition, 
panaginip. So, kung ano yung nakikita mo. Why? Kasi I feel like there's this past relationship right here na nagpapakita. Meron, pwedeng sa dreams mo nagpapakita itong person na ito na nanggugulo ngayon na nagkakaroon ng kaya third party relationship dito. Retreat. Meron kang kailangan alisan. Meron kang kailangan tapusin. Alam mo yan sa sarili mo. Kailangan mong free. I-free yung sarili mo sa bagay na alam mong hindi tama para sa'yo. Why? You deserve love. Karapatan mo lang ang mahalin at ang magmahal dito sa tamang tao na, um, you know, alam mo naman yun kung sino yun eh. Kaya lang, it's like, you're just not, don't, don't give up. Kung, I feel like you are connecting with the past person, pero it's like you're giving up and then parang binibigay mo napipilitan kang ibigay yung full love mo dito sa new person or dito sa karelasyon mo ngayon I don't know have faith practice compassion maawa ka sa sarili mo kung sobrang nasasaktan ka na tuwing gabi or dyan sa kutob mo na yan nafifi, nasasaktan ka dyan sa kutob mo na yan ma you know yun ang advice sa'yo. So, thank you for watching. I hope naka-resonate kayo. Please do like and subscribe to our channel, Unicorn Princess Tarot. And maraming salamat po.